Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Reading and Retail. If you're new here, my name is Crystal. So I'm just getting off of work. Um, I'm gonna do a video, of course, a little vlogging, little decorating. Um, it is 4.55 right now. I had to stop at the post office because, as promised, I am, I had to stop and get stamps. That way I can mail out my Christmas cards. So yeah, hope everybody had a wonderful, what is today? Is today Wednesday? Today's Wednesday. I don't know why I can't keep up with the days. Yesterday, I thought it was Wednesday. Uh, I don't know what day it is anymore. You know, I pretty much gave up trying to remember and figure it out. I had to, I've never purchased one of these before. I had to purchase um, a global stamp. Uh, my friend Mandy over at the Night Owl told me to get this and I confirmed with the postmaster that this is what I needed because one of these cards is going to Jamaica. So I was like, do you have something called a global stamp? I know I probably sound like I'm crazy, but I've never purchased one before and I need to send a letter, a Christmas card to Jamaica. So Miss Rose did not forget you, honey, bonnie, bonnie. And then I'm gonna go ahead and stamp all of these and get them in that mailbox. That way they can get out. Um, I got, it looks like a Christmas card. Hopefully it's not hate mail. It looks like a Christmas card to me. I don't know. I guess I'll open it up on camera and see. I did get hate mail one time and I was like, oh, why would somebody do that? But whatever, man, whatever. I'm not going to fight YouTube. <laughs> I ain't. Look, if you like me, I love you. If you don't like me, I still like you. I mean, what can I do? So I'm going to go ahead and finish placing, placing the stamps on here. That way I can get them in the mailbox. Um... I don't know if I'm going straight home yet. Um, I might do some shopping, I'm not sure. So, um, just keep on watching. Um, hang out with me and um, I lost my train of thought because I'm too busy trying to put stamps. <laughs> okay guys, I'm back at home now. Um, I came and I took away everything that was fall the fall leaves the pumpkins all of that and i pulled out some of my christmas christmas items that i'm using um to decorate my bookcase now i like gingerbread just keep in mind that this is not the finished look i may add a tree i may add some christmas lights this is just what i actually got out of the box and got up on the shelf for now so this right here um, is something that I bought last year from Dollar Tree. And this is just a little wooden storage house. And I thought this was super cute because it did go with my gingerbread theme. And then this is a gingerbread candle holder with the little faux tea light. So I think that's going to look really cute. Um, when it's dark in here because you could leave those on all night it doesn't matter and because you get them at the Dollar Tree two for a dollar so um, if the candle goes out just go buy another one they're 50 cents and then I think I got this little gingerbread last year I do believe yes I got that last year I always put the dates on my um, ornaments just to keep record of how long I've had them. I started doing that when my kids were really small and I think I have ornaments ornaments back from when my son was five or six years old and he's 22 now. So here's another gingerbread I put up here and then last year I got this little mug with the gingerbread theme as well. Um, another little house. I decorated my cubicle last year with 
um, gingerbread. Two more of those. Now this book here, I always have this on my bookshelf um, just because I love this book so much. Um, I think I did a video on this book. Um, it's very elaborate. There's um, pictures on the inside. Um, they look like oil paintings to me. It's very well made. It's got the gold trim. And I got this book last year for a dollar. And I couldn't believe it. Okay, um, I got this little tin that actually has comfort and joy and the gingerbread theme as well. And let's move this out of the way here. It doesn't matter if it looks crazy now because I'm not even done arranging it and buying things. Because like I said, I may add Christmas lights, I may add a tree, I may find more gingerbread decor. So this is a little tin and I got that at the Dollar Tree last year. And I love the top of it. Have a cup of cheer. If that is not me, that could be cocoa in there. Um, I know people that actually put whipped cream in their coffee. Um, hey, if that's what they wanna do, that's their business. That's what they like. And then I got two of these canisters last year they're stackable oh here let me show you they're stackable on the top like that and it goes along with this this matches this and then this goes along with the have a cup of cheer as well and I love this oh it's so pretty so these are a few items that um, eventually, oh, that's gonna fall. Let's not do that. Eventually is going to make up my um, holiday on a bookshelf. So I'm gonna pause you just for a second and then fix this mess. Okay, that looks better. <laughs> I had to fix it. Uh, so yeah, um, this is the start of my holiday on a bookshelf. And mine is going to be gingerbread theme. So if you'd like to do this and decorate, I'd love to see what you come up with. All right, guys. I hope everybody is having a wonderful night. Um, stay safe out there. And I will see you in the next video.